The school system cites personnel issues as the primary reason the school year is being pushed back to a September 15th start date, but that gives teachers, administrators, and parents, including those associated with Ridge Hill Elementary, time to get ready. Most of this summer, the principal and custodians have collaborated here at Ridge Hill Elementary School. Look at what are our numbers, how many kids do we have, how many classrooms and grades do we have of each, and really make sure that we're separating everybody out. And the school's open floor plan is a big help. Meaning, um, you know, we have uh, four classrooms within a big, big unit that's separated by bookshelves. That's actually served us very well for social distancing. We love our school. Um, I love the principal. I love how the teachers interact with the children, the staff. But she says her three children who all attend Ridge Hill will take part in distance learning through at least the first semester. My husband and I, when we've been doing very well um, with, you know, getting the reading, the writing, the arithmetic done, and as well as making sure that they engage in the physical activities. Not knowing how diligent other families are in enforcing the proper protocols push them to be cautious. So with that said, I just feel that it's important for my household that I keep my children at home. And the Hamden school system is prepared for distance learning. Everybody's got their own laptop or Chromebook and um, provided by the district. Keeping the students at home engaged through their virtual classes um, and real-time group work with other kids and with the teachers. The school system says they're leaving no stone unturned. Plenty of PPE and directional signage in the hallways, plus plenty of spacing in classrooms and restrooms. I'm Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.